Well, hey, all my itchy skin friends. So today we're going to be talking about dry skin, otherwise known as cirrhosis, especially in the winter months. So first, before we start, let's go ahead and look at the layers of the skin. So we have the epidermis here and the dermis here. The epidermis is what is going to protect our skin and keep our moisture inside. Okay, that consists of stratum corneum, stratum lucidum, stratum granulosum, stratum spinosum, and the basal layer. So now the names aren't really important. That's a lot of like jibber jabber, whatever. But what is important is protecting our epidermis. All right, so our epidermis is like the wall to our house. If we don't have the wall to our house, then everything inside is not exactly protected from the outside. Now, why are the winter months so freaking horrible for our skin? Well, there's multiple reasons. A, it's cold outside and there's less moisture in the air. So those both things are gonna take moisture from your skin. And then if you have wind, wind can be damaging to the skin. The other things are when you get home or you're inside your house, you're usually using heaters, which also take moisture from your skin. And then you're taking hot baths, which take hot baths or showers, which take moisture from your skin. And then once that moisture gets out of your skin, you're gonna notice that your skin is gonna start getting itchy. And why? That's because the barrier to your skin is actually messed up. So what can you do for this? So I have some two products here that I use and I think that they use, they work very, very well. So the first one I'm going to be talking about is the Blue CeraVe. So this one is very awesome because it actually has ceramides. Remember when we were talking about ceramides are part of our epidermis and that is something that keeps it together and keeps it strong for us to help protect us from losing moisture. It also has an emollient, which is petrolatum. So that'll help trap in the water. And this actually has hyaluronic acid in it as well. So hyaluronic acid is very good at keeping the moisture in too. Now, if you do have itching, <laughs> look at this pretty kitty. <laughs> So if you do have itching, I have something for you that you can use as well. It's going to be the CeraVe in the red bottle. So you can also get this in the tub form, but I use these together in the winter months. For me, usually I start getting itchy in my torso and in my legs. What makes this different from the blue one? Well, this one has an ingredient called permoxetine. So permoxetine actually goes straight to the source and stops the itch. So I use these together because this one I don't feel is as thick as this one and as moisturizing as this one. So I put this in the areas where I have itching and this all over my body. So how many times should you be doing this a day? So you should be doing this at least twice a day. If I can get at least one use or you to do this one time, then I hope you would at least do it one time. And the best time to put it on is when you're coming out of the shower. However, you should not be taking showers multiple times per day because the showers and the hot water are gonna strip the moisture from your body. So right after you get out of the shower, you wanna go ahead and lather this all over your body just to make sure you keep that moisture in because once the water stops drying from your body, it is gonna take the water from the skin as well. Now, another thing to remember is try to cool down your water temperature and that will help moisture stay in moisture stay in your skin as well and think about even if you are taking hot showers or baths try to decrease the time that you're doing it in well i hope some of that information helped you today and you're going to survive this winter and the itchiness that comes with it and just remember that you want to continue to use this about twice a day even when your skin feels better the best way to prevent dry skin is to use this twice a day, at least if I can, like I said, once a day, and then I'll help you out from your skin ever becoming dry. All right, guys, please remember that if you liked the video today and you learned something and hopefully it helped you out, remember to go ahead and like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.